guys, Musa here, and today, you know, if you have a Mac, which I don't, this is the guest computer, but I recently figured out that you can open Windows programs and, you know, you know, do Windows stuff almost, you know, with the Windows EXE folder using a Mac. All you gotta do is have Wizard 101. It's, it's really weird. So, yeah, just go. If you open up Opera, whatever thing you have. Um, we, I'm um, like the cheat engine is, um, it's like, um, whatever, I, I'm not really sure what it does, but apparently it's a EXE folder, as you can see in the top left hand, a top right hand corner, it's an EXE folder. So after you have the EXE folder, drag it on your desktop. Then, you gotta open Wizard 101. Let that open, you know, let it do whatever it has to do. So then, all you gotta do is hit file, no, yeah, file and run command. Then you gotta drag the cheat engine all the way to the command, then hit run. You don't even have to sign into your thing. So after that happens, you hit, you know, it, it worked. Look, you're, I'm running it on the setup, you know, it's everything. So you can use a Windows, so pretty much you can download custom zombie maps. Here. Well, I mean, not necessarily. I have no idea. But, you know, this is useful if you have an EXE folder and you want to, you know, yeah, as you can see it next and then um, finish. And it'll be, uh, it'll be right there. So, as you can see on the bottom, let me see, I'll drag it onto your desk. I'm going to drag it onto my desktop. Let me get rid of all this stuff. What, what are you doing? Let me get out of here. So, let me just Get out of here. Let me get out of Wizard 101. Let me get out of Wizard 101. Let me just get out of Wizard. Oh my god, okay. So after you have that, you know, you ha you extracted it. It's right there. Um, as you can see, it's in download. You know, you can trash the on thing first, but here, as you can see, if I go to that, my applications, it is. Uh, let me first find it. Okay. It's not okay. Well, you know, you can do it using Wizard 101, and the reason I we can't find it, but it's somewhere. It's I don't know. You usually use Wizard 101, and then you extract it by that. And as you can clearly see, it was open, but I think as I was, you know, going through Wizard 101, I think it's sort of like I accidentally deleted it. But you can use Wizard 101 just like that to extract exe folders using a Mac or any other like MacBook, whatever. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe and, you know, thank you. Just name it right here. How to extract an EXE folder using a Mac. Oh, using Mac. On a Mac. Save.